Ghana National Ambulance Service says the no bed syndrome at major hospitals is posing a huge threat to their service delivery. Director of Operations at the service, Forstan Songbijan, says the inability to have patients immediately admitted at hospitals leaves ambulances waiting when others require services. The operations of the National Ambulance Service surged last year after its fleet was increased. 20,000 cases were transported compared to 6,000 in 2019, but the service still has challenges. You also face challenge of prank calls. That is a major concern, prank calls. As you speak now, in a day, we can receive over, let's say, about 20,000 calls. Now, all the emergency services, ambulance service, fire service, police, NADMO, we are all on the 112, which is the short code. So if you are not in need of any of these emergency services and you call the line, it means you've engaged it. The time that somebody who really needs the ambulance calls or any of the emergency services calls, the line will be engaged. The unavailability of beds in some hospitals especially, the major ones is also thwarting the effective delivery of its services. What people are saying that we said patients should procure a, a bed before we transport them, that is not the truth. But the real truth is that we expect the referring hospital to arrange with the receiving facility that indeed we have this patient with this condition and we want to refer that patient to your facility. He urged clients to make the necessary arrangement at health facilities before making a call to the service. If the receiving facility agrees that yes, we have bed, so bring that patient. Then we expect that referring facility to call the ambulance service to come and transfer that patient to that facility. So always, what our dispatch center, the first question they will ask that hospital doing the referral is, have you made arrangements? If they say yes, then we want you to give us a contact person at the receiving facility to be, for us also to call to be sure that, yes, indeed, you've made an arrangement and they've also agreed that the patient should come. Foster Anson Brejan further called for a collaboration between the service and the major health facilities to ensure that patients receive the best care at all times.